Hello guys, it's Pircro and a few of you asked me on how to install the file to play mode uh, uh, on Darkest Tower, so this is how you do it. You need to download uh, all the files that uh, from the link that I will post in the you know video description. So after you download all the files, you just you know uh, let's just you have to unwrap all these files and uh, unwrap them like this. Just unroll all the files. So. I'll be right back when my uh, files unroll. And I'm sorry. Uh, okay, so all my files are you know unrolled now. And I'm sorry I forgot to mention that. Just when you download, just create a folder named XODD a desktop somewhere. And just place all the files that you uh, downloaded in that you know folder. So now that we have this, these things uh, unwrapped, you can just delete delete them. And you have this install you know uh, package and click it. Double click it. And everything's going a bit slower now that I'm recording. So it'll take a few moments. I'll be right back when you know when it's resumed. Okay, so now you should get like something like this, and you just click on I agree, and mm, you just click, you know, both of them. Uh, go next, and you don't. Uh, the easiest way to do this is just to make a new uh, a new folder on your uh, desktop and name it like I don't know, F O D D main mod files or you know whatever you just install it uh, in there it's gonna take uh, you know 830 uh, megabytes and I'll be right back when mod finishes installing okay so our installation is completed and just just click close and now we have uh, this here. Now we have these two folders, this one with the main installation, which opens up this folder with Dark Star. So let's just enter here and into mods and into FODD. So these are the main mod, mod files and you'll go back to this first folder and you don't need this anymore but let's just leave it for now. And you you take all of the files in FODD 207 and you just copy them or you know cut them whatever uh, I just copy them and, and copy them into over over these files here like copy them in here and overwrite and everything I just hate how my computer is so slow when I'm recording or anything uh, but yeah but I'm too lazy to pause this every time I need to waste on to load or copy ok so we copied this one now we have a version of the game which is uh, 207 and you click on remove uh, 1936 remove the to you know get the correct uh, date in the game so you start off in 2045, uh, 2245 and not 1096 one, uh, and you just get this one and you just click you know any key and it just you know completes. So uh, the next one, ne the next patch is FOD08 and you copy that one as well and you just copy it. In, in the same you know FODD folder from the FODD main mod files and just you know uh, copy them and just you know copy them uh, here as well and click yes to all or whatever when they are when the you know, when the PC asks you you want to override anything or something yes override everything. It's 
quite easy. I don't know why, why people you know, haven't been able to install the mod. So you just take this hotfix A and you take the then txt and you copy it into db files. Like I think it's db files. I'm not sure. Uh, what is db files? Yes, it was. It's copied it in the db files. It's really you know set or copy it. Actually, copy it in the db files. So uh, for music, you just take this music folder and you copy it into into this folder so it overwrites any music you already have or just add more music yes uh, copy and replace uh, I'm not actually sure if this is needed I'm not sure if the music is already in the game but just in case you know if you want more music and stuff just don't with this I I'm actually not sure if, if this will add more music but just in case you know so um, and that's that. You have this perfectly, you know, perfectly patched game, and I already, I don't really need this folder anymore. So uh, I'll just delete this folder with the mod, you know, stuff in it. it. Takes up quite some space. I mean, 800 megabytes, nothing but still. And the next thing we want to do is second. Oh my God. Okay, so next thing we we have to find. Out. Is we have the FODD, uh, just a second. Yeah, we have our FODD folder from the FODD main mod files where we installed the game and patched it. And now we uh, find our uh, the installation folder of, uh, of our game of Darkest Tower, and mine is C Games Darkest Tower. This is the default the installation path. So uh, you can see the launcher and everything. So now you just uh, go here into mods I this is my old you know file doomsday mod folder but I just you know moved it out of mods so I can show you guys uh, again how to do it so you just enter mods and this is where all the mods will be you know placed uh, placed or all the mods need to be installed and if you don't have the mod folder just uh, you know make one and we copy this uh, this file uh, be careful so when we enter um, a folder where we installed we go in here and then we go in mods and then we copy this or cut this I'm gonna cut this and we just you know paste it here shouldn't take long uh, yeah it's finished so now we have the, the FODD folder here and we don't need this empty folder now and once we if you wanna start the game we go in the darkest hour launch, launcher we select you know preferred settings or whatever Second, everything's still slow and we load the mod we choose from Darkest Hour Light at least for me and Kaiserai and if you wanna play Follow Doomsday you just load you select Follow Doomsday and load the mod and click launch and if you wanna change this into the normal game you again you know you, you, know, you start a launcher and you choose a different mod the default mod and normal game is Darkest Hour Full uh, and this is the, the file Doomsday mod so thank you guys for listening and everything I hope this helps and if you keep getting uh, your start date uh, in 1936 uh, just go again in the mod folder and just uh, click on the remove uh, 936 bat and yeah that's it so enjoy your game and follow my vid vid videos uh, I know I know I haven't recorded in a while but I'm ready to continue my uh, let's plays so check it out sometime next week and I think I'm gonna have some more videos you know available and everything so thank you guys for watching uh, this video and bye